but as you already know you know destiny will always win and i do hope whoever does win her destiny shines the brightest tonight alam naman natin that you can never celebrate until the crown is on your head so we just have to always do our best until we reach that goal but just on the note of krishna i do think she is just absolutely perfect for for what miss you i mean for what miss world stands for rather yeah i i've been following i've been following all the girls and all of them have been doing really 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 good okay what's our cup of the day so every morning we rian and i actually have this drawer this cupboard full of just mugs that are either given or what we buy for ourselves and every day parang nag-iiba iba yung yung bansa so my dad kasi he actually started this he collects um a mug from from starbucks for every new country that he visits so sometimes it's going to be well this isn't from starbucks but this is a manhattan mug and yeah, so if I do go live more often, then Sikuri will see different mugs. The only mugs that I do not keep in that drawer are the ones with faces. And alam niyo na yun, gets niyo na yun. Happy birthday, M. M. Sam 2011. I'm seeing some viewers from Florida. Hi, hi, Gretchen. From Angie, we miss you too. We miss you, Po. I miss you all too. Kamusta naman kayo? Uh, today, uh, Dave and Nelly will be arriving in about 30 minutes. I am receiving an award today at the Memorial QC Circle. So it's the Philippine Legacy Award. And I'm very excited to grace that event and speak for the people that really need that representation so it is for pwds also and for people that have been championing for that sector as well actually that's so true what good is your platform if you really don't put it to good use i mean you know when you're a public figure you really have to be responsible for the kind of influence and example that you set online and offline so when you do have the chance to just show other people that you're a good person with a good core then by all means live your life with purpose is abe here i'm seeing a lot of abe hi abe abraham babraham What's up, Dave? Gracia, that's how are you? I haven't seen you in a minute. Abraham, if you're here, let's let's see if Abraham would come on. How do I add somebody again? Abe, 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 Abe. Go live with Abe Lawyer. I wonder what he's doing. I hope he's not. Medyo nakakatawa ako, no? I set up my iPad right here para makita ko yung mga comments nyo. Pero nakaganito pa rin ako kasi hindi ako mapakali kasi delayed yung live sa iPad. So I'm seeing some questions. Are you going to the GMA Gala? Yes, of course. So much awaited GMA Gala 2024. I am very excited. Um, Rian and I have a room right next to each other. The ball major clingy come in. But it's gonna be fun. Uh we have a lot of things planned for Personify as well. A lot of juicy content that's going to be coming out. Uh Kayoba. Um yeah, so recently, recently I just finished a shoot. And actually not today, but two days ago, I did a shoot for uh, an announcement and I actually changed the creative direction and uh, it's, it's something very new, something very, uh, I know, first time could go in. I've done pegs like this that are pegged to be this way, but for this shoot, I actually 
just did it. Hindi siya kunwari. Ang hirap, no? Ang hirap i-explain kasi ayoko siya i-spoil. But it's, it's, it's a really nice concept that, that the whole team kind of just had to think on the spot because of some limitations. But I think it'll be really good. From Labio, JMR, pupunta ba kayo sa Mexico para suportahan si Chelsea sa laban niya? So first and foremost, I think Chelsea is doing an amazing job. And I do think she's going very far in uh, in Mexico. My involvement, or rather if I am going, quite frankly, oh my gosh, that part of the world is just so, so hard to get to. But if I was extended an invite by the organizations, then of course I, I'll consider it. But as far as now, I, I haven't gotten an invite. And medyo tipid tipid lang tayo kasi masyadong maraming gastos lately. Ang mahal mumili ng airplane tickets, guys. Tipid tipid lang. But, 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 regardless, I would love to go. I would love to have the chance to watch from an audience perspective naman. And again, you know, by Nihan Spirit Loud and Proud, we're we're all here for we're all here for Chelsea's Chelsea's chances to the fifth crown. Hey. 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 <laughs> hey ka po muna, Miss D. Hey. <laughs> Grab it. I just, quick rant lang. You know, I I've been on Twitter actually quite quite um quite I guess more more recently now. I mean, I've been more active in the recent days, and all I can say is, you know, good energy, bad energy, whatever that energy is. I just want to remind everyone: love, respect, and kindness. That's always our priority. Let's refrain, especially from sending threats, especially life or death threats, or anything that just causes any sort of negativity online. Let's, let's always be part of the solution. I know a lot of us are very opinionated, but let's just try to be part of that positive impact. Alam ko naman that a lot of us are very sensitive with what's going on nationwide and globally but again there's just a lot of noise online and for us we just have to know who to listen to know where our core is and know that for whatever we do we have our intentions in the right place so just reminding everyone that let's always choose to be kind let's always choose not to be part of any any negativity alam naman natin yan that it's always best to think before you click yeah ayun let's always just keep that in mind and i have to talk a little bit slowly when it when it comes to that because i don't want anything taken out of context i i respect everybody's opinion i validate everyone's opinion but i do feel very strongly with people that kind of cross that line in terms of you know just just taking things out of context and and just just that yeah ito gvgv lang tayo i'm seeing a lot of people with birthdays j x i x happy happy birthday Sino ang bias mo po, Sabini? Actually, they're all, they're all, all the songs I love, they're super nakaka-LSS, but um, Bini Maloy is the only one that I actually had a personal interaction with na nakapag-usap kami. And we still have to find time to do our um, Pantropico challenge, but I guess if I had to choose, um, then I would have to say Bini Maloy just because I, I met her in person and we were able to talk because of my my guestings on, on Showtime. But oh my gosh, lahat ng songs talaga nila nakaka-LSS, no? Galing. Okay, so 
you guys have any questions, now is the time. Uh, medyo kalahati pa naman yung kape ko. And wala pa naman sila, Dave. Hey, Ed J. Paul. How are you? Do I listen to new jeans? Oh, naman. Who doesn't? Mark, salamat! Hi, miss you! Mark and I worked on Keys to the Heart. If you guys, if you guys saw that movie on Netflix, it was an amazing project with amazing meaning. And it got really good feedback globally. So very proud of the whole team and the production. And of course, Netflix Philippines. But hoping for another project, Mark. Kamusta po? Everything's good, busy, busy as usual. But I always say that busy is good. Alam niyo naman ako, I have ADHD. Kaya hindi pwedeng walang ginagawa. Uh, usually if I'm up, like nagigising ako at 3, 4, 5 a.m. And it's just so hard for me to get back to sleep. It's like my, my thoughts and my brain just automatically wants to work. Because there's just no time. There's not enough time in this lifetime. And you know, my stance on how time is really <laughs> the most valuable resource that you can never take back, replace, or control. Kaya maximize all the time that you have to really get the things that you want to get done. And if there's one advice that I would give everyone time and time again is do not wait for opportunities to open up for you. Be brave enough to create those opportunities for yourself. You just have to get creative. And I'm also seeing a few people asking about my cap. So this is MND. This is actually a prototype. It's a sample that I am not happy with yet. Um, so there's just a few quality concerns. This is just, I guess, a quick sneak peek. And then I can go back on Twitter and see if you guys have any comments. I had white denim and black produced. But essentially, the going style is that there is this, what do you call this? Basta ito. Basta ito. Huwag niyo na asarin. Basta yan. Sabaw pa yung utak ko. And this has to be much longer. The denim. Not too happy with the denim color yet. And also, the logo. I'm not quite satisfied with the quality of the logo just yet so i spilled for that but it does look good on video so let me know what you guys think and what you want me to change or if you have any merch ideas i do have a couple of things that i know i promised but are on the way it's Claps 28. <laughs> date reveal sa GMA Gala. Nako, personify yung kadate ko sa GMA Gala. So, wala akong kadate. Um, but yeah, I'll... lagi ko naman kadate. Yung plus four ko is my digital team. <laughs> Exciting though, because personify is doing something with GMA mismo. So, you know, very blessed and grateful for all the opportunities that that life has just been presenting to the businesses and the things that I'm passionate about. Alam niyo naman that I'm such a creative. I love being hands-on with anything that involves creativity. Kaya expect all of that creative giggle to come out, especially during events like that. Will I have a bathrobe Dao? That's not a bad idea, actually. You know, I'm always... Like, if you see my closet in my banyo, I have so many bathrobes that I do use on repeat, but it's... I really want, like, hotel-quality bathrobes now. And maraming mura. Maraming talaga mura. And it's just about keeping your eyes out for the right quality. Kaya malam mo. Why not? I see Crystal. Hot air balloon story reveal. Okay, so a few weeks ago, I went to Turkey. I went there on a... It's, it wasn't on a whim, but there was just a big schedule change on my end. Um, I was supposed to come back on the 22nd, and then that whole event just got cancelled. And 
yeah so anyway i just ended up going to turkey since i had those days freed the naman and grabe i somehow i feel like i was so um just so astonished with how beautiful the culture was especially in cappadocia and i have I have been in hot air balloons before. Pero kasi yung naranasan ko lang before is akyat baba, akyat baba eh. But in Cappadocia, it was, such a, it was such a different experience because you... Fun fact to whoever might be thinking about going to Turkey or Cappadocia to experience that iconic hot air balloon moment, they only, um, they only take off before sunrise. So that's the only time you can capture that image. And... For my experience, it depends on who you book with. We took off and then we ended up in a completely different area. So we literally went across town via air. And then what seemed like an unplanned landing was just really their pilots being so skilled at landing anywhere. I'm sure it was a predetermined destination, but for us, it looked so random, just like a patch of, of, like just like a small small field like a really small field and a hot air balloon that can fit 20 nasakto pa niya dun. and then after like five minutes the 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 transport of of the hot air balloon basket arrived and that's where the pilot landed it on it was literally the the bed the truck bed of of the hot air balloon yeah it's it's it was a different experience of course next up on my list is actually solo skydiving that's number one on my adrenaline junkie bucket list is to get that solo skydiving license and to really just skydive all over all over the world number one in that destination i would love to be able to skydive in hawaii you all know my love for the beaches um of course all around the philippines and just to kind of see that perspective from the sky falling and Shemper, we have to get over our fears in life. And one of my biggest fears is actually falling. End of charot! Alam niyo yung feeling na ang taas-taas mo na sa area. Tapos, I'm not scared of heights, eh. It's just this, the fear of falling. Hey, Casey Gemtala. <laughs> Grab him pics mo sa turkey. Galing ni Lady Tan. <laughs> Saan nga ba si? Hello? Edre, yes! Let's have coffee with Mick very, very soon. Say my name, say my name. And no one is around you. Say, baby, I love you. Yeah, to everyone that flew to uh, Thailand, thank you so much for supporting Anne. It was a really good show. If anything, Miss Universe Thailand really knows how to put on a show. And uh, I would have loved to see that live. But again, busy, busy is good. But I'm just glad a lot of you were able to experience that for yourselves and show love from the Philippines. What is my plan tomorrow? So tomorrow actually is going to be the first time that I am getting ready for the ball very, very early in the day just to get a lot of my commitments done and also just to give my creatives more time to be able to to perfect the concept that we have. Miss Era, see you tomorrow. Miss Era is with Bello, and we all know how much I love my Bello family. To those that have been tagging the billboards everywhere, all over the Philippines, thank you. So I was just at Bello last week, and um, I actually wasn't supposed to be in Bello this specific day. Um, I was supposed to be a floor below it, and when I walked to the area, because the same area, different floor, I look up and then it was my face because I was walking while, while answering emails and then I saw my face and I was like, oh, that's me, but this is not where I'm supposed to be. 
But yeah, I super love my Bello family. Uh, thank you for taking care of my skin and my body. Thank you for making me Bello ready. I also had a shoot um, last week with GAOC and very happy to to once again be working with GAOC. Actually, I've been a GAOC baby for, for many, many years now since the start of my career. Kaya, the whole support that they gave me even vocally or just behind the scenes throughout my journey was just amazing. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Doc Dan. I think this is one of the longer lives that we've had, no? I'll say, yeah. Press, press one if you want me to go live more regularly. I am just trying to once again log on to my iPad. Um, there is just something I'm trying to figure out. What's up, Vince? I have a question. Um, when you go live on Instagram, are you allowed to play music in the background or mommy mute ba ako? Can you can you press press two if totoo? Like, kasi para ang tahimik pero ayoko kasi na mamute ako because of copyright or music issues. Pwede naman no? Filipinas. How's your new Mac? MacBook Pro, oh my gosh. Okay, I just have to say that the new MacBook Pro M3 Max has been handling all of my materials just flawlessly. Even the new uh, iPad M4. So the other day, I shot that campaign that I mentioned earlier, and I think it was about what, 60, 70 gigabytes in total. It was a very quick shoot, so... 70 gigabytes, if I put that on my old laptop, it would take like 10, 15, 20, 30 minutes to transfer. But I transferred it on my iPad M4 and it took two minutes. Two minutes for 60 gigabytes. Like, how is that possible? Good energy. Puede po background music. No maganda. No verification failed. Bakit? So on this iPad, I'm actually still in the process of signing into a lot of things. Because as soon as I opened it, um, it was very heavily used for like editing and all of my creative software. So I actually haven't gotten around to logging into any socials or any messaging apps. I've I've maybe just been on like Lightroom and Premiere and Illustrator here. But yeah. Okay, imagine how thing you here is just trying to um fix all of that. From Janelyn, play my only baby. Ito na naman tayo. I don't, don't know if I'm signed in on. <laughs> oh, I am. I'm signed in here. Nice. Uh, don't allow. Choose. Ask app not to track. Of course. I love that. Only baby. 
this this the 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 vibe of our stream now it's it feels like when it was during the pandemic and i was streaming um on facebook at the time and i would just play music all the time Di pa nga siya ubos eh. Bagal. Kasi, wait, ayan, kita niyo ba? Meron pa yan. <laughs> Where am I going? So I'm waiting for my hair and makeup artist, Dave and Nelly. And we're gonna get ready for an awarding. So I will be at the QC Memorial Circle today. From I think one one p.m. or two p.m. So for anyone that's free, feel free to pass by. Hope I can see you all there. <laughs> what is my coffee? Question. Um. What is my coffee? What's the three in one show? Happy birthday, Nins! Good question, and Sherin Kiming. Kamusta na si Teresa sa Black Rider? So ayan si Teresa buhay as per her last reveal, and uh, I think, I think, I think bawal ko, bawal ako magsalita. <laughs> <laughs> um am i watching house of dragon best believe i'm watching house of dragons um i may not be a that big of a fan of house of dragons compared to game of thrones but grab it this season grab it it's, it's kind of intense I have been rewatching um, a couple of other series also, like The Good Doctor and Suits and House of Cards, but I don't really have much time to watch online. It's usually really just when I need to fall asleep and I need that noise in the background. I miss it too. Next music. I tweeted, I tweeted something earlier, my song of the morning. It's called Good Energy. And nakikita ko din na hinahamon niyo ako magtagalog ha. Kaya ko kaya magtagalog, kaya nga ako natuto magtagalog kasi nung mga grade 3 or grade 4 ako, ako po'y um, binuli. Mas lai na awa yung ko dati kasi English era daw ako kaya kahit baro ko ho kino hindi siya kinabukasan basta the following year um super tagalog na ng tagalog kahit baro ko ho and ganun ako natuto Syempre nakatulong din na naging artista ko at, at na challenge naman ako sa mga script and ngayon confident naman ako na kapag nasa television ako kaya ko magsalita <laughs> Hey. Akala nyo, akala nyo ha, minsan nandito ako sa bahay tapos sasabihin ko, nasa na yung pitaka ko? Tapos sasabihin nila yung pitaka? Pitaka, wallet. Diba? Akala nyo. Mara Christina 813 hi from Makati hey from Makati too Okay so I think I have about 5 minutes left for the live um uh, I just saw a message from Dave pop up na malapit na daw sila Ano yung banana clip di ko gets Di ko talaga gets I uh, know yung announcement ko. Actually, I was just telling one of our friends earlier that it's a little bit hard to share because there are a lot of things being worked on in the background. Um, but you know, it does involve a lot of traveling and a lot of 
Filipino representation. And no, it's not another pageant. Um, we'll leave that up to the universe to decide. But this is something very exciting. Uh, a goal of mine that I didn't think was possible way back when. So dreams do come true. You always just have to move with purpose. Know that you're not living with the sole purpose of just like contributing to that negativity. You know, God really does reward you when you give out positive energy in the universe. I am rereading a book that my father gave me that his mother gave him. So my grandmother, um, it's called the law of divine compensation. And essentially it's not, it's not, it's not really just or anything it's just it explains how the universe does reward you for the things that you choose to do on a daily basis it's very energy centered that's why i also move as purpose i also make sure that everything that i do is in line with my core values and what i believe in also okay yeah. always choose love kindness and respect you know yun Arn Patrick, MMD, B-Day ko po. MMD plays Salamin, Salamin. Say your last man. Dahil birthday mo, last song for you. And kapag naubutan niyo si Dave, sabihan niyo sabay-sabay natin, sabihan na ang banda ni Dave. Ay, tamar siya, kasi siya. <laughs> Salam mo talaga mong paturo sa mayaw. DJ MMD, hey! <laughs> Jenolyn, kailan ka mag-US? I will be back in the US maybe 3rd or 4th week of August. Natatawa ko ako manda kasi alam niyo naman ako napaka hindi ako hindi ako ma-lyrics like ang hina ko sa lyrics talaga so baka mabasa ko si Vita may lyrics kaya by vibe lang tayo <laughs> So, sana bagulong pa yung shape na ito eh. Napagalang sa Sino po nagagandahan niyo sa Bini Ate? Tama ba yung nagpabasa ko nun? Honestly, I think all of them are so talented. Let's look at their cover photo now. Alam mo, they're all so talented. Pero, if I may, ang galing ng ano nila, digital team. I love their, I love their cover arts, album covers, I love their fashion. Um, but again, yung nakilala ko lang in person kasi si Bini Maloy and I love her. I love her energy and I love her personality and you know, it's it's just unfortunate now we only had like five minutes to chat, pero great first impression of mine and we were able to connect online and yun lang, it's just aligning schedules and seeing if we can do the Pantropico challenge or another challenge, of course. Ako, ninth member of Bini. Since hindi ako nag BBP, baka umabot sa Bini, no? <laughs> Mabos na siya. And perfect timing also. Oh, 
Okay, that's all we have for today. I have to get ready um to prepare for for Dave and Nelly. Kailangan ko na grow and everything. Um, but I just want to say thank you for everyone that joined us today. I really miss going live and I miss catching up with all of you. If you have any questions or concerns, you know, I'm I'm always on Twitter. Um, I have my broadcast channels as well. I'll try to I'll try to put a question what do you call it best of those polls on the broadcast channel so don't forget to check out mmd is typing on my bio here on instagram and if you want to tweet me that's michelle md on twitter but i just want to say thank you for catching up and just spending the morning with me kape kape tayo in the future actually in the very very near future i do intend to go live more often but thanks so much for the time everyone i love you all